the nature versus nurture debate in psychology. The issue focuses on the extent to which genetics, nature, and environment, nurture, shape human behavior, personality, and development. On one side, nature proponents argue that our genetic makeup, inherited from parents, plays the primary role in determining our traits. These include intelligence, personality, mental health conditions, and even behaviors. Research supporting this view comes from studies like twin research, where identical twins, who share the same DNA, often exhibit strikingly similar characteristics, even when raised in different environments. This suggests that genes strongly influence traits like intelligence and temperament. On the nurture side, psychologists argue that environmental factors, such as upbringing, culture, education, and life experiences, play the most significant role in shaping behavior and development. For example, children learn many behaviors by observing others, as shown in Bandura's famous Bobo Doll experiment, where children who watched adults behave aggressively were more likely to imitate that aggressive behavior. This demonstrates the impact of environmental learning on behavior. A more modern understanding of the debate acknowledges that it is not nature versus nurture, but rather how they interact that matters most. For instance, epigenetics reveals that environmental factors can influence the way genes are expressed. Genes might predispose a person to certain behaviors or mental health conditions, but the environment can determine whether or not these genes are activated. This means that someone might inherit a predisposition for anxiety or depression, but whether or not they develop these conditions can depend on life stressors, trauma, or support systems. Psychologists today largely agree that both nature and nurture play essential roles in human development. The interaction between genetics and environment is complex and dynamic. Human traits, from intelligence to personality, are shaped by an intricate combination of inherited genetic predispositions and the environments we grow up and live in. If you learn something new about how psychology affects our daily lives, then consider subscribing to my YouTube channel so that you don't miss the next episode. Until next time, stay sharp.